I'm a staff scientist at the Wilderness Committee, Canada's largest environmental group, 70,000 strong, and we're here, all of us, in spirit. And uh, it's an emotional issue for me. I come from a long line of uh, miners from uh, Butte, Montana. The biggest copper mines in the world, the site of the largest uh, and most expensive environmental reclamation project in the history of the world, $5 billion to date. My ancestors are all dead. They all died of cancer. They're all miners. They got poisoned in the copper mines in Montana. There is no way to do copper mines right. I've been studying copper mines for a while. And we either, we have a choice. We either leave for British Columbia, a wild and spectacular and beautiful place, or we pollute the hell out of it. Copper mines are the bad boy of the mining industry. There is no way that you can have a copper mine that does not destroy water, that does not pollute, that does not dump sulfuric acid into the rivers and kill fish. So we have a choice in this province. We either lead the way forward, the way the Chilcotin people and others want to go, or we wreck it. And that's it. Thanks.